One of the weakest links on the lower receiver and where we see a lot of people getting in trouble are these lips where your trigger guard is pinned through. Uh, when you're putting that pin in or taking one out, you have to support it or that'll snap off or if it fractures, you still uh, render the lower uh, useless. We've come up with a family of uh, gunner's pucks. This one happens to be for the trigger. And what we've done is we've machined it such that it will accommodate the bolt stop, the selective fire, and this area right here is where the pistol grip would go. We have it raised, and it's such that it's right over a hole right here. It'll fit into the gunner's mount. You can safely put it in, line it up, go ahead and tap that pin in or install it, and it's all supported. But one of the things we want to take a look at, although they're all mil spec, we do find there's some different thicknesses to the OD of these lips. The ID is all going to be the same. So when you do put it on, we want to take some feeler gauges just to make sure it's loading. In this case, we've got about five thousands. That's not a problem. She's going to load right in on it. So trigger puck, save those lips.